Hello everyone, I'm getting this thing straight. I hope everybody's doing fine, seeing if everything's going all right, and it seems, it appears to be. Um, I'm back again this week. What we're going to do is the, um, the next, the next course, the next uh, lesson, which is, um, we talked about it a lot. Um, this one is going to be called, um, this one is called, um, Expert. Expert 1, or I'll put Roman numeral I, and it's the separation, I don't know if I put down separation, but the separation of weight, I don't know why I'm getting a, a little nervous, probably because it's pretty, because it's a lot of things to learn in this one, but it's the separation of weight, energy, and balance. Okay, now I'm back. Now I'm all right. Um, I hope everybody had a good week. Uh, it seems like I got a good response from A and B, the updates. The updates were very, very important because it lets you know what was happening in the course because I did a lot of videos on Dance Without Music. Also, like I didn't put down, um, that's the title. It's Dance Without Music. I, which is Roman numeral I, or one, and um, weight, balance, and energy. Weight, balance, or energy. The reason why it's such a, um, the reason why I'm stalling with this is because it could be weight, balance, um, energy, energy, balance, weight, it does make a difference so far as which one I put first and which one I put in the way I categorize it. Okay. So today we're getting, we're into expert. Like I said before, it's so important that you now, no matter what, you're not going to do this one or really do this one the right way until you're ready anyway. And like I said, it'd take 18 years to get to the, the last one as far as the energy is concerned. Okay, so now, now I really don't have to worry about putting in any advance or whatever because it won't happen. It won't happen unless you complete um, the understanding of uh, A, of update A and B. Um, now, I, because I don't have so much time to figure out all these things, I'm doing so many things, mostly work. Um, I know I just figured out that the video well they do updates on the on my phone all the time and one of the updates which was really good and I never noticed it is that when I do videos they cut off and make another video after um, like a half an hour okay so that's why there's an update A and B I wanted to do it all together but you know that's the way the thing is it's very trivial I never I didn't really catch it because I hadn't done a video in a long time. Uh, I hadn't did a YouTube in a long time. So this week, I kind of like fancied up. I put some like, I put some. I was going to go to the store and get um, some mousse. <laughs> I, I tell you, I, I've been through so many things with all these Sebastians and stuff. And I noticed one time, I mean, one time at one point in my life, Moose was important to everybody. I've been through the time when Royal Crown, Grease, you remember the movie Grease or whatever? So when everybody used to put grease in their hair and then they went through something called um, Moose. Everything was Moose. And now I went back to get something because I wanted to look a little bit presentable since it's an expert lesson. Sometimes I kind of dress up. I don't like to dress up, but I kind of like had to do some you know, some maintenance <laughs> so that uh, you will, I don't know, it'll make things better. it make me more charming, I guess. But I'm not a person to dress up, but I do like dress up sometimes. Um, so I kept looking in all of the, I found out, I looked at, I go, there's, there's not moose everywhere, you know? And that was in the past. Um, so I just decided to put some petroleum jelly in my hair and I'm gonna see how that's gonna work as far as 
my hair is concerned. I, I, I don't use shampoo. I don't use anything. I just put soap. But now I'm going to uh, I'm going to try this. Maybe it's good for my my hair. So anyway, that's just a side subject. And that's something just trivial information about myself. So now we're getting into expert. Like I said, the title is expert. I for one is the first one is the basic expert. So we're starting back over. I don't have to put any warnings or anything because you won't, it won't happen at least until like 18 years, but it's good to watch because watching it and, and talking and listening to what I'm talking about will help you complete the beginning part. Okay. It'll help you in the journey because it's going to take a long time, but you need all kinds of hints. So actually looking at the experts will definitely, definitely help you. It gives you a direction, a goal. Okay. So I got that out the way. There was something else I wanted to um, make as far as uh, the expert lessons. Um, I said that A and B is very important. Everything that is said beforehand, I can't repeat it. I mean, that's the best thing about this class is that, I guess that I, I can't say the best thing about the class, but that's one thing about this class. Well, I guess it'd be good because all the information is there. You just have to go back and look at it. But there's one thing about the class is what I can say is that I can't, I can't refer back too much. I can kind of get some in, some um, synopsis or some kind of review of what had happened sometimes. But because it's so much information, even little pieces of information, um, I, I can't do with the time, the way the time is, it's just always there. YouTube keeps them stored. So that's very good. So now we're going to get into to this expert. Okay. Like I said, it's weight, energy, and balance. I can kind of make it into what's the most important. I guess I would just say weight, balance, and energy. And I say weight balance and energy, and that's probably what stopped me before because I didn't know how to, I didn't know which one will come first. I guess if I had a choice, I would put weight first because that's what we, we talked about was weight first. Weight, and we're more familiar with weight. And you have weight no matter what, even if you can't balance. So you have weight, and there was times when I couldn't balance because I had a lot of just things that you go through in life, like when your feet are hurt and you can't really balance, but you still have that weight. So you have weight, balance, and energy. So I guess I will definitely have to put the title weight, balance, and energy in that order. And that's what we're going to talk about today. I'm not going to put the fact that it's about the separation of, okay? So <clears throat> it's the separation of weight, balance, and energy. So if you come this far, like I said, you can just watch it or whatever, but if you come and actually get what we're doing, because in everything that you do, you have to get it. It's like um, typing. You have to get it. There's a point to where you get what's going on. Um, in singing, you, you have to get it. Um, this courses will help you with before the basics. That's what I'm saying. That's what I want to state is strengthen that ability to go into something that you don't know anything about and start and have a good start. Okay. But it's before, it's like before the basics. Okay. So if you get this, like I said, if you go through all the points and you're doing very well, like I said, I can't help it. But I have to stress this, it's going to take a long time. It's going to take 18 years for you to get up to, like I said, the, the last segment on, I don't know if it was seven or eight or whatever, but it, it had advanced, advanced, the first advanced one. It's going to take 18 years. What's the problem with that? Because we live in a society where everything has to be done quick, but it, it, life is not like that. And there's some things in your life that you have to say, 
I'm, I'm going to die trying. Have you ever had that, heard that expression? I'm going to die trying. That's a good expression. It's saying it's not saying that you're going to die or that you want to die, but it's saying that you want to continue to do this and, and you're not going to let other things get in the way. You're not going to say, okay, I have to do this in a time. Because any talent doesn't have a time limit on it. I mean, if you want to learn the piano from the, from the beginning, it's best that you say, you can't even say, I'm going to know piano in one year. The arts are things that, there's certain things in life that you can't put a time limit on it. And I also want my people who's watching this to break free from always saying that this has to be done at this time or this has to be done at this time because not everything is like that. Now you're putting things in your life which you're in control of the time. And it's something on the side, so you don't have to worry about any time. But you always get, you you will always get, um, you will always get accomplishments. You will always get progress reports. So you can see yourself doing better, little by little. Okay, so now, now let's get into this. I don't practice that much because it is... This is more like a journey of perfection or precision. Yes, per perfection or perfect or pre precision, definitely. So I don't practice that much to do these YouTubes, first of all, the time. But practicing also shows you other avenues. So if I practice, I'm going to go off into other things that I'm going to learn. But I'm learning this and I'm structuring this lesson as a journey in step by step. So I'm showing you that it's not perfection now. We don't have, at this point, there's not perfect, perfection or exact precision, but we will get to that point, okay? Um, like I said, it is definitely, um, this is definitely formatted in um, a dedication to Michael Jackson who passed away and also using mostly from a lot of things from his dance that he did in Thriller on a Thriller video or his album. His album which came up with the video, okay? So here we go, we're gonna start. I'm gonna do this, I'm gonna, oh, let's, I wanted to get the tools, the things this will also, what I want to say is that this will show you the different avenue for the expert also. Because in the first segments, we have tools. And all those tools are going to change. What were the tools? Let's, let's, first we had the tool of walking, but we used the walking as a beat. And I'm going to show you that. We did this. And we did go, then we went back, and then we had the fast, and we did that, and then we had like a rhythm, okay, and then we went back, or the rhythm, remember? So we can't, so those are tools, things that we can refer to to get something accomplished. We had the fat, we had the, so we call it the slow, we had the meat, we had the fast walk, and then we had the went into a rhythm. So you remember that those things were tools. But now I'm going to do the expert lesson that we're, the first expert lesson that we're going to get into, and then we're going to talk about it and see how things have changed. I'm not, I don't want to say too much. Like I said, we're going to get in other lessons that sometimes when I do things, as I do more, you're going to have to catch certain things. Now, this is important that you see what's going on, okay? Because sometimes um, it's not really, you can't, okay, right now, we won't be able to explain completely about everything that's going on because we're making something new we're talking about precision that hasn't happened yet okay thank you
Okay, so that finishes it. Okay. Now, this the only, the difference that we have is that it's not just movements. Okay. Before we had fast, slow, and rhythm. I haven't looked at this on video. I just did it just now. I planned it and everything. I did a little rehearsal, but not too much. Um, but this is the point I want to make. This YouTube is the separation of weight, balance, and energy. Okay? So... What was done is the fact that we've gotten to a point, and I'm saying as if everybody's completed everything, and we even talked about gravity, that's gone, okay? So now we're at the point to where we are going to separate all these events that happen um, while we're doing dance without music, okay? So, the difference is, is that when we walked, we didn't just, we don't just say beat, like fast, slow, and then rhythm. Now, it's more internal, okay? We have to see, on the first part, I tried to stress, as far as the dance is concerned, I tried to stress the fact during the dance, the part of that dance, the first thing, stress, weight, okay? There was a weight. We're not using, at this point, I'm just saying, I'm, ta I'm referring to um, being at this limit, Okay, everybody, now I'm referring to you as if you went through everything, maybe after the 18 years or whatever long it took you. And I'm saying that now we have to see, I'm not speaking in a time to when we were doing the first lessons. I'm speaking in the time to where we completed up to this lesson. We're not just looking, we're actually doing it now, we're ready. There's no more, we, we're, we're going to um, not throw away, but we're going to put aside the tools that we had before, which is left, right, um, your foot, your leg, your, 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 right hand, your right hand, your left hand, your left hand, or right hand. Anyway, this flips around, so uh, that doesn't do any good e anyway. But we're not saying your hand either. We're not saying your chest. We're not saying your waist, okay? But we're saying what we can visualize or what we can see. Maybe it's another sense in our mind. And what we sense now up to this point is our weight. In the first part, I stabilized weight over here. Or it could be over here because it flips around. But I stabilized weight. Then I balanced it. And then I used energy to move around in a circle. Okay? The important part is that you get the fact that... I mean, I know I have legs. I know I have a body. I know I have my arms. But... I'm controlling the control in the visualization of the weight, the visualization or the control of the balance, the visualization and the making up or controlling the energy. So that's the separation. At this point now, you can, and I'm speaking to those who, as if you're ready, you have to, now you can, you should be able to see the differences. Like I said, I threw away, I threw gravity out the window. At the last advanced lesson, it was at first advanced, first and last um, YouTube, it said advanced, advanced warning. 
and after that I threw away gravity okay picture gravity as something that was you ever played the game hand sis, um, rock scissors paper rock scissors paper okay it's a game it's just a game okay but it's a concept as to clear up this thing about gravity paper remember paper putting something the paper goes over rock and that was that's the concept that i'm trying to say paper beats rock because it covers the rock okay i'm sure you, you look it up if you don't understand paper scissors um, I mean, uh, rock, scissors, paper. Okay. So that was a game that we would play. We would say in, in the game, which I'm not going to go through the game. I'm just going to state that paper covers rock and paper beats out rock. But in taking away, I'm using that example to take away the gravity. If you take away gravity, gravity is like the paper. So you can, if you throw away the paper, you can see the rock, but it's just a game because in real life, we need paper, we need rocks, and we need um, scissors. And they all work together for us to build technology and all the things that we need and everything so they utilize their tools. So I'm saying if you take away gravity, like you take away the paper and you just don't, I mean, that's, you, you put aside that game, you can have all those three things and we can use them now. We can separate them. And in real life, we do use them and we do separate rock, scissors, and paper. So now, I want you to realize what happened just now and show you that we have weight, balance, and energy. And before... When we were doing this in the beginning, in the beginning sections, it was all together. It was just what you saw was what you did. You would record what you did. And then you seen it and you record what you did. And I said looking in the mirror. There's nothing wrong with looking in the mirror. But I was saying when you dance and look in the mirror, it's not good. Because now we're getting to the point of why. Because... Um, it's not nothing, anything wrong with the mirror. It's nice to have a mirror, but I'm saying when you dance in front of a mirror, you kind of get the concept of what you see in the mirror. And the, what a mirror actually does is it has rays, rays, I mean, like from the sun, like from light. And you record those rays and you kind of put it into your dance. So your movements is not as humanly and it doesn't look as humanly as it would if you would now come to this point and not see the mirror, but separate and utilize and control the weight, the balance, and the energy. It's just like when I did this, okay? Now I'm doing this. And I'm controlling, and I can see it clearly as day, which means that I can do other things, you know what I mean? Because now, it's not just like doing it before, to where you've seen it and then you did it. Now, this is the most basic movements because it lets you, because now I want you to separate those things, okay? <laughs> And we're going to have, there's so many tools. Now, it opens up a new world. Because now we're getting into what we've seen all the time. Flashes maybe. But now we're going to use them and strengthen them and control them to work for us. To where we can be more precise in our dance. I mean, totally precise in our dance. And... Even if two people are doing the dance or three people are doing the dance now together, um, as precision goes on, as our perfection goes on, we can um, communicate that separation that we have and that control that we have of the weight, 
of the balance and of the energy. Okay, so that finishes that. I also did part of, I did some things, I always keep it up, like what I said, the um, format and the thriller dance that Michael Jackson did. And that was in the, um, when I did that, okay? Because in this, and I also did it with this first balance, okay? This is, I'm not saying it's the first balance so far as a balance, but this right here is also a balance. But we don't notice it unless we're on this one foot. But our major balance is, is a major balance is here. Like I told you, this section has a lot, a lot of nerves, a lot of things that are going on. But we don't worry about that. And we don't, we're, what we're into now is the separation of balance. And that's what I did in this part. That's a plane with the balance. And then... I didn't lift this leg, but I played with this balance, and then I came back to this one, and it's in that dance, and then I did this. But it was just mostly playing with the balance on that, okay? And oh, there was one thing, other thing that I wanted to do was, and this is just really, really uh, one sm small point. We're pretty much finished now. But I wanted to do something like this, okay? As far as balance is concerned, to separate balance. Oh, I don't know if you can see it, but... Okay, and then I'm in the center. I call this the compass, okay? And I think we're going to use this. But what I do is there's a balance here, okay? And I stiffen everything up. We're not gonna get into any other tools yet. So I think of the point in the center of the compass, okay? And you're gonna go north, and you're gonna go back to the center. Then you're gonna go south, and you're gonna go back to the center. And then you're going to go East, but these things switch around so it could be east or west. So I can say east or west, and then it goes back. And then east or west, and then I go back. Okay, so you can break that down to where it's like a compass, but it doesn't without north, south, east, and west. So I would say this forward. And then I would say backward and back in the center. And then I would say to this side, back to the center, and this side, back to the center. And we're going to use that. That we did on the dance lesson, the, the first and only of dance lesson, you saw energy, okay? You notice I separated energy for you. And this one is about energy. And this one is about added, I mean, it's, it puts in energy along with weight and balance. That one specifically shows you balance. I know you lose, use everything, but it shows you the balance, okay? And the weight is something that we're familiar with everything. Everything you lift has, has a weight. I can lift this contact solution thing, okay? So that's about it. It's, it's it's about to turn off. I, I, last time it was supposed to be one video, and um, it ended up two, but I explained to you why. So I hope you enjoyed this one. I don't know when the next one is going to be. Um, I don't know exactly when. I know this covers a lot, and this is a very important video. And this, like I said, now we have separated if I speak to you as if you've already completed everything, now we're separate. We have separated weight, balance, and energy. Okay. Now we have those tools. We have those three things, and that's uh, a pretty big deal. So now we don't have to worry. We we'll, we can see how they relate to our steps. Our small steps are. Our, um, our slow steps, our fast steps, 
and our rhythm step, steps. And you should be able to see the difference in what we're doing in this expert lesson. Thank you very much. And I'm looking forward to the next expert. It's going to be I.I. for the second one. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.